Hi, everyone. Today's topic is technology, that is, world's longest submarine by Russia and world's fastest bullet train by Japan. And topic, other than technology, is flat earthers. First of all, we discuss submarine. Russia launched the world's longest submarine, the special mission submarine Belgorod, designed to support a variety of military missions, including the Poseidon Long Range Strategic Nuclear Torpedo. The sub is far larger than anything operated by any other naval force, including the U.S. Navy. The 600-foot-long submarine displaces more water than a World War I battleship and can dive to a depth of 1,700 feet. The submarine was launched today, April 23rd, at the Svmash shipyards in Russia, with Russian president reportedly watching via satellite, officially known as Project 09852. The submarine was originally an Oscar II class cruise missile submarine that the Russian government ran of funds to complete. The submarine hull sat unfinished until Moscow decided to complete it. As a special mission submarine, the hull was lengthened to approximately 184 meters 604 feet and the ship's displacement ballooned to 30,000 tons submerged more than 50 percent greater than the u.s navy's ohio class ballistic missile submarines the result of an unfinished hull the belgorod is a one-off and there will not be another one like it although built to conduct underwater espionage by far the most Sinister mission for Belgorod is as launch vehicle for the Poseidon nuclear torpedo system. Poseidon is a very large torpedo, 65 feet long and 6.5 feet in diameter, with a range of thousands of miles and a top speed of 60 knots. Poseidon is believed to carry a 2 megaton thermonuclear warhead and is designed to go around U.S. missile defenses to strike coastal targets including ports and cities. According to H.I. Sutton, Belgorod will carry up to six Poseidon torpedoes. Next topic is the world's fastest bullet train. Japan is testing Alpha X, the world's fastest bullet train, pushing the limits of rail travel as it begins testing the fastest ever bullet train capable of speeds of as much as 400 kilometers per hour. The train is scheduled to go into service. In 2030, rail company JR East plans to operate it at 360 km per hour. That would make it 10 km per hour faster than China's Fixing Hao, which links Beijing and Shanghai, and has the same top speed. The Alpha X is a testament of the growth for the Shinkansen that is bringing the era of high speed rail service from a dream to a reality. This news of Alpha X testing has come when the new high-speed Shinkansen N700S is still undergoing tests that had started about a year ago. N700S is slated to enter operation in 2020. However, it will be sporting a top speed of only 300 km per hour, similar to other N700 series trains. It is no match for the maglev train that achieved 603 kilometers per hour on an experimental track back in 2015 next topic flat earthers spent twenty thousand dollars only to prove that earth isn't flat let's say you had twenty thousand dollars to spend what will you do with the said twenty thousand dollars something great right as it happens a group of flat earthers the name given to those who believe that the earth is flat that has been starred in the Netflix documentary called behind the curve decided to put this amount to a good use proving that earth is flat well the said group of flat earthers ended up accomplishing the complete opposite end scientists and engineers can't help but laugh according to the Space Academy one of the flat earthers is Bob Nodal he is also the host of a YouTube channel that is aimed 
at explaining the flat earth theory. Along with his team, he was sure that a $20,000 laser gyroscope will help him prove that the earth is flat. However, sadly enough, they ended up doing the exact opposite. Thanks for watching, JTV.